Right, this is a continuation of the coastal walk on the 23rd of March 2016. Prior to the season of the cow, this Paulet walk along a bank is three and a half miles. I've got to do it today because um, I'm busy at the Easter holiday. Um, it's supposed to rain tomorrow. I'm picking Zara up on Friday. Um, so basically, this is the only day because it'll be the season of the cow soon. You see, it will be the season of the cow. And basically, all where I'm going to walk now will be overrun by very frisky cows who've been in all winter and will be very, very frisky. Now, it doesn't mean I'm not going to meet any further up. I'm going to go, as, I'm going to do what I can. I can see somebody else right over there. Somebody else walking. It's not a bad day. Out of the wind, it's quite, well, it's quite mild. Out of the wind. Just met a local lady from Paula. She, she's never actually walked where I'm going to go. She's local, lived there all her life. But of course, with the signs, Paula, three and three quarter miles. So what I've said to myself is, Allow yourself three hours walking and then you've got to turn back because um, I, I left the church where I parked Alberta at 12 o'clock. Um, I've stopped to chat. I've stopped to chat. And um, so this is the start of the walk. I'm following that bank all the way around. There's somebody right over there. I don't know which way they're going. You just hope you don't meet the nutter. You just hope you don't meet the nutter when you're out. And last year when I came here there were cows all in that field there and they were up here. I'd seen this, I had seen this ramp, the signs weren't up so clearly. But the ramp was. Yeah, I can see somebody. I reckon it might be a bloke. Walking quite fast. Might be a woman, who knows? And it, at the moment, it's quite pleasant. It's a bank going all the way round. And the tide, when it comes in, I imagine, when the tide's out at the moment, I imagine it comes right in up to here, look. So on my return trip, I could actually find that I'm walking with the sea in. There's a bank further over that you probably could risk, but then you, I reckon you could get cut off. But at the moment, it's looking quite good. From right over there, I can actually see... Oh, he's got a dog over here. It's right over there. I can actually see another signpost. Right over there somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, it's over there. There's a signpost. Over there. So I've got a head for that. Now I haven't got. I've only got my windshield in my bag. I didn't bring a big heavy coat. I'm not going to video the whole of this walk because obviously you can see I'm following a bank. Um, so I'll just announce some news that came through yesterday. Um, there's been an ISIS attack in Belgium. Uh, happened over 24 hours ago now at the airport, at Belgium or Brussels airport and um, in some other buildings in the city. Um, I think over 30 have been killed, over 225 injured and maimed. I think it's quite a serious blast. 
Um, a week ago they captured a terrorist um, who was responsible for the Paris bombings. He was involved with it, put it that way. Um, so that's the news at the moment. Uh, the other news is, I, Ian Duncan Smith, who was pensions, work and pensions person, has resigned. He's resigned saying he thought the cuts, the cuts to disability were too much. What a load of rubbish. He's a liar. He was the one pushing for it. He was pushing for disabled people to lose their benefits. Their helping hands, their mobility scooters, their high toilet seats. People that would come in and help them go to the toilet and wash. He was all for it. He was smiling, ready to tread his boots on the faces of the poor and the vulnerable. Now he's resigned. Running scared, I call it. Anyway, that's some of the news. President Obama visited Cuba. First time for, well, I don't know how many years. Could be 60, I'm not sure. But a long, long time. A lo yeah, it's got to be quite a long time. Making ha peace with them. Um, and all that sort of thing. Right, there's someone coming along with a small little dog. It looks like a woman's walk. Um, over there I've got the Church of All Saints and All Angels or something, that one, at West Huntsville. Brent Knoll right over there, which you can't see. Can't see, oh yeah, right over there you've got Pinkley Point, the River Parrot. So I'm going to turn off for a minute. Paula will be over there.